All right, man, we talked about Arby's like a couple weeks ago, which we didn't know that, well, at least I didn't know, Pusha T wrote the Arby's jingle, and also he wrote the McDonald's jingle and didn't get any royalties from it, and they paid Justin Timberlake $6 million to sing it, um, and he only got like a couple hundred thousand for writing it, and that just lets you know that um, he didn't understand the importance of royalties and stuff of that nature, but he did get royalties on the Arby's commercial, but now Juicy J is saying that Arby's took some of Three Six Mafia's productions without clearing it, or they took some samples without clearing it. So let's talk about it. That subscribe button, dump, bell icon button, share the video. And um, I haven't heard it, but I heard some people that heard it, and they said that it's kind of a stretch. But we'll see. We you know people quick to come back and say, "Oh, this guy took our sample." You remember of uh, you seen the Wu Tang documentary when he had took the um, I think it was uh was it Denise Williams? I just wanna be free. When he sampled that song and they didn't clear it and he had to redo that song and the RZA lost his record contract, they do that all the, all the time. And sampling was huge in the 90s as far as productions. And, you know, it got to the point where a lot of producers and, and record labels and musicians got sued for sampling. Um, and a lot of these older artists or these artists that originally, you know, used the, the you know, the part that they sampled, will come back and sue the artist and the label and all those type of people and the producer. It used to now you used to have to you have to clear them. And apparently Juicy J and I put it on the screen said that Arby's did not clear 36 Mafia's production. And apparently he deleted that tweet. So I don't know if it was wrong or he just wanted to keep his legal case, you know, um on the low. But at the end of the day, if they wrong, Arby's won't have no problem breaking off money. Arby printing money. I think they own some. They own something else. I think Arby's and Buffalo Wild Wings are the same company. Don't quote me on that, but um, I mean, but yeah, I mean, the difference is when they use our stuff, it ain't a big deal. You know, we supposed to shut up and, and and be quiet and and just and just shut the hell up. But when we sample some other people's stuff, they want to make it a big deal. But you know, plagiarism is 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 crazy, and it's basically what it is. But we we'll see if. DJ Paul and Juicy J got a case. Um, it's hard. It's hard to prove sometimes, but if they use the sample, you know, Arby should just keep this, you know, out the loop and just pay him. A uh, member Takashi Six Nine used that uh, African Boy sample, and he gave him like a thousand dollars, and he was crying over a thousand dollars. My G, I'm mean, using your sample. It should have been like you should have got a hundred bands. I think he got like a couple thousand, a few thousand, or something of that nature. But for Juicy J, do what you got to do. You know, that's, you know, that's some good money. That's some money that, um, you probably could retire on, you know, you and DJ Paul. So, I mean, if you produced it and it's your work and they stole it, it's your right to go out there and make them pay for it. If, you know, they paying Pusha T a lot of money to write their jingles, shit, you made, you made the production. Maybe you can, uh, get paid and also get paid for making their next jingle production. So let me know what you guys think. Uh, Juicy J saying that they basically about to sue Arby's for stealing their production or sampling a production uh, in a commercial. So let me know what you guys think. Don't forget we on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. You can reach out if you have a business question, cry, response, your video request. Keep sharing the videos. Want to make a donation to the channel? Uh, just share the video, but cash app PayPal in the description. Cash app CJ Good 313. But let me know what you guys think and check out music entertainment playlist for more videos like this. We done.